And we are back with Elden Ring, baby. That's right. We are back indeed. Going to quickly uh, assess the stream sitch. It's all looking good. Close some windows so I don't have any unexpected and unwanted lag in the game. And everything looks fine and dandy. So, we are back now with Elden Ring. Part Dubli, Stream 2. Um, the first stream basically covered the tutorial. Uh, and let's be honest, I spent more a lot of time making my character. Which I did warn you guys beforehand was going to be a problem. So you can't really say, I didn't warn you, yeah? I warned you quite a bit. Now... Okay, that is up, Twitch is a go, Facebook is a go, and uh, yeah, YouTube is a go as well. So let's go. Oops. Whoa, it's night time already. I didn't know there was a day or nightism in this game. I speak to this person with a very strange looking face. Oh, it's a mask, okay. Oh, yes. Tarnished, are we? Come to the lands between for the Elden Ring? Hmm? Of course you have. No shame in it. Unfortunately for you, however, you are maidenless. Without guidance without the strength of runes, and without an invitation to the round table hold, you are fated, it seems, to die in obscurity. All right, so I have to go to something called the round table holds, it seems. Luckily for you, however, there is one shining ray of hope for even the maidenless, me. Vare, take care to listen. Are you familiar with grace? The golden light that gives life to you tarnished. You may also behold its golden rays, pointing in a particular direction at times. That is the guidance of grace. The path that a tarnished must travel. Hmm. Indeed, Grace's guidance holds the answers. It will lead you tarnished to the path you are meant to follow, even if it leads you to your grave. Yeah, I know all about Grace. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the fellowship of the Holy Spirit. Amen to that, brother. All right, so... Um... I just realized, is there a leveling up function here? Well, there is obviously. Where do I do it? Past time. What's past time? Is that it? No? Flask? No? Memorize spells? About them. Ah. I forgot. How do we level up in this game? It has to be here somewhere. How do I, how do I level up? And I better not lose my... Uh... Ruins. Okay, see? Equip load, okay. HP. Ruins held. Yeah, ruins needed. So I need 829 ruins. So I still need some more ruins to my next level up. Okay. So that's okay. I can manage that. 
What else is guy? This guidance will reveal the path forward most certainly to Castle Stormvale over on the cliff, the home of the decrepit demigod Godric the Grafted. Godric the Grafted. How many Godrics are in this game? It's time you set off, I should think, to Castle Stormvale on the cliff. Where grace would guide you, if you seek the Elden Ring, maidenless as you are. It's time you set off, I should think. Or dialogues is pretty awesome, actually. The fact that they actually went through the trouble recording them. That's where the shards are going. I'll follow them. Oh, actually don't do that, because you can see people died. Instead of using their brain. I'm obviously going to be using my brains. The few I've got left, few brain cells I've got left over. Yeah. Maybe that's why I call people in. Inventory. What is this? How come there's skulls everywhere? Yeah, that guy looks dangerous. Maybe I should avoid him. For now, that is. Where is this castle grey skull I'm supposed to be going to? You know what? Maybe I should run there. And see what's going on. Ooh, what's that? Shiny. There you go. I pillage the corpse. They call me Mr. Sheep Hunter. What's this? A rune fragments. There's a lot of fragments around here. Grab them. What's that? I see something shiny. Whoa. Okay, I see a fire going on. I'm gonna go there in a sec. Grab these shiny things. Shiny bubbles, as they say. Okay, jumped over. What's this? Is this a secret passage into this? Oh, no, it's not. It's the thingamajig. The building's just fallen. Alright, I see some materials there. Any enemies around that I need to be careful of? Doesn't look like it. However, I do see something shiny. So what is this? It's a bunch of rats, I guess. Whoa, look at that! Jeez. Okay. I'm actually scared. Should I risk it? I'm not sure. I'm not sure, man. Let's just finish our farming run. They should give some XP for farming. Like normal games. And again, I don't think... I don't think uh, from software go games are what we call normal, are they? Tell you what, though. It's would be nice to play Bloodborne 2 at some point in my life. Bloodborne 2, I mean like Bloodborne is one of those games where I don't know if it, like as much as I want a sequel, I don't know if it needs a sequel. It's just such a beautiful game. And the, uh, definitely my favorite Soulsborne game. I do like Dark Souls 3 quite a bit though. It's one of the out of the three Dark Souls, that's the only one I finished, so you know, I said something. <laughs> uh, Demon Souls, I loved it. I would probably say Demon Souls is. 
Okay, maybe I'm gonna step on some toes, but I would argue Demon Souls. I found Demon Souls better than Dark Souls. Sorry, Dark Souls one and two. Oh, there you go. That said, I also have to say I think the reason I like Demon Souls is because it was more like Dark's. Well, the reason I like Dark Souls three more is probably because it is mo the most like. Demon Souls. So. Okay, so it seems I can't climb that area. So, wait, why was I climbing that area anyway? Go away. Okay, let's. I'm just gonna go back to this. We're gonna see what the light is about because it's taking me to that direction anyway. Where I see somebody on a um, somebody with a fire lit. So I'm gonna go check them out in a sec. So. Do I press this? What do I do? I see the light going there, so I'm just going to follow it, it seems. So you can't really interact with the light, unfortunately, it seems. Now, I could go there, but I want to see what these ruins are about here. Is there an item there that I need to know about? Okay, hopefully this guy doesn't see me. Okay, he didn't. Good thing I'm sneaking around. I hear people groaning. Oh wait! Whoa! Whoa! Okay, I hear a lot of people in pain. That does sound nice. Oh, what's that? Is that a dragon? Oh, it's, it's a bat. Oh, okay. I mean, I suppose they're going to be fierce as well, but let's be honest. Oh, man. What is these sounds? Somebody's in a lot of pain. Wait, is it a bat that's making all that noise? Oh no, it's people. They've hung up or like on crosses or something. Oh man, that's so bad. I see a bat sitting there. I see a bat flying around. I see three bats there. I could fight them. Or I could just... Well, I can try fighting and see what happens. Oh, look at those guys. Oh, they're still alive. Oh, there you go. Hello, Batsy. Come at me, bro. Come at me, brother. Yeah, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, come on. Nice. Come on, come on. Vanquishing enemy group will replenish your flasks. Enemy group. Oh, if I kill a whole group, I get my flask back. That's actually interesting. Okay, so enemies will be in groups, but designated groups. Okay. I got a golden ruin. I'm not sure what that does. What does that do? Inventory. A golden ruin. <sighs> Nothing, apparently. Uh oh, I used up my flask. No, not what I was looking for. Oh, look at that guy. Well, unfortunately the game cheated a bit, because even though they recorded voices, it, they're not moving, so... Aha! Check it out! 
There's a church there with the fire, I guess. And I can see a light shard in there, so I'm gonna go there. However, I might just take down some of these enemies, I see. Exploration is key. Okay, why have people died here? Is there somebody here? Okay, unless that sheep is mad, I don't think I'm in trouble. What are you doing, man? Block! Got a shield there! What a noob! I, of course, speak of myself. I literally have a shield there, I didn't even use it. He saw me. That messed up my... Does he see me? He does. Oh. Oh, no, it didn't work. Alright, so it seems that chump attack doesn't necessarily stun them, so... Ooh, bolts. That would be cool if I had a crossbow, that is. What's that shiny bubble there? Looks a bit dangerous, to be honest. Looks like meteorite. What happens if I break it? Oh, it's like the thing. Oh, I get it now. This is the upgrade stones. Oh, nice. Scarabs, that's what I'm talking about. In the old games, there used to be little lizards we kill. Okay, there's some ruins there. I think I've gone off the beaten path a bit. I think I'm going to go back to where I was. See an enemy there. Sneak attack him. Sneak attack fail. Uh, 
That was so bad. That music hits nice. Let's see how effective stealth is. Oh, it's actually quite effective. <gasps> it was anyway. That everyone. <gasps> nice. Bro, I'm loving this loot system. I pretty much got most of these. Got some nice weapons, man. I can try out. Now, this guy, can I kill the turtle? Yeah, everybody's dying here for some reason, so I'll try not to. Let's just follow the set path, follow the light, the grace. It's getting wet as well so I should probably take some rest in this place I see before me the light is definitely going there so that's where I'm supposed to go quest wise ah it's the church of Ile. oh there's a Santa Claus sitting there Merry Christmas boy what I'm gonna do first is Where's that fire that I noticed from far away? See, that's the horse guy, okay? I should obviously be careful from that guy. But... I did notice a fire somewhere far away. That's where I came from. Oh, maybe it's underneath there. It's here. Fire. I'm sure I saw fire here somewhere. Oh, what? Did I miss mistook for something oh no i've been here before right i've been here oh that's the only thing how do i know what places i've already explored it can be so hard i'm gonna keep visiting the same places again that's why i just followed the light drawn stop being so distracted why is this glowing skull glowing wait something happens if i break it Oh, 
Wait, don't tell me I was supposed to break the skulls. Right. I yeah, messed up. You know what? I think this is it. Maybe this was a fire. Church of Ailey. Okay. Smithing table where I can spend runes, smithing stones, and strengthen my weapons. That's pretty cool. I can use that. Okay, and then we go to... Speak to what looks like Santa Claus. Tarnished. I can see it. And I can also see that you're not after my throat. Then why not purchase a little something? I am Carly, purveyor of fine goods. Hmm. What's recommendation? You know, if you can spare the rooms, you should buy yourself a crafting kit. A crafting kit allows you to make basic items on your own. Essential, really, if you intend to survive out here for any duration. The kit costs a bundle, and I admit I do take my cut. But the important thing is that you survive. Every customer counts, after all. That mule looks worse for wear. I am of a nomadic people, selling wares as I travel. The land has been tainted by madness since the shattering of the Elden Ring. It's only tarnished like yourself, who keep things from drying up entirely. Let's say you're a very welcome customer. Purchase. With shop menu, you can spend runes to purchase various items. Ooh, what's this? Chain armor. Oh, I completely forgot you can buy armor in this game. This is a crafting kit. Osran 300. Practice of item crafting. Kind of items there. Can you. I wonder if I can make my own flasks or something. Actually, no. Flasks are free anyway, so what's the point? First of all, let's just go here and level up. that day. Oh, I can't level up. It's so annoying. How do I level up? I'm just going to store everything for now. And what's this? Straight sword? Long sword, straight sword. This one is... was lighter this one's better actually should probably switch them.
Ooh, there you go. More critical, lighter weapon. Uh, physical, it reduces the physical. Magic, guarded damage negation. I just use that to be honest. Let's try that. Okay, not the best looking weapon. Get a crop ticket. Wait, weren't you? Well, you're back. Care to buy something? You know, if you can, you should buy yourself a, cra a crafting kit. An essential, really. The kit costs about the import. Crafting kit, it is. Crafting kit, you make various items. Cooks. Okay, inventory. To my equipment, go with fire. There you Magnifying glass, so funny, so cool. Oh, wait, can't I zoom in or something? No, I can't. Great. Not the best choice, it seems. Well, let's make our way to the next point. So this just shows me how to go from port to port, it seems. It's not as exciting, but it's not as exciting as I thought it would be. Question is, how about I try killing that guy on horse? You can see loads of people died trying the same thing. But what if I have more luck? Here it comes, guys. On backstab. Uh oh, maybe not. Maybe not the best idea I've ever had. Oh, hundred percent damage to gone. Oh, this reminds me of the Sekiro fight. Oh. Uh oh. Well, thankfully I didn't have any harnish points, as they say.
Obviously, I need to get good before I can take that guy down. I probably also need a horse. One or the other. Wait, I didn't expect you to change my day cycle, though. It's just done. Oh, thankfully, I don't actually have to kill the guy to get my runes back. So that's good. I can just go up to here, get the runes, and then run away as fast as I can. Best strategy in the game. Run for your life. Now, next bit of this map. So that seems to be the castle I'm supposed to go to. But I'm just going to go see what's going on on that side of the map. Because there's definitely um, a little village there. Oh, there's the... Oh, no, that's the end. That's a bad guy. There's a cave there. It's a little sus. Is this a short... Oh, nice! Another portal. gonna go be a little Rambo on that side first before I go explore that dangerous little hole yeah come on how did I not dodge that See another shiny skull. Another golden ruin. Oh, I think ruins are what I can use to basically get. Um... Oh, that's a skull there. Okay, nothing comes off a empty skull. It has to be glowing skull. Like that one. Another point, another light point. Look at that map. Nice. Oh, I've seen this thing in the trailer. It's a dangerous path. The guy just throws stuff at you. Ah, uh, yes, I know this bit. Okay, there's a chest here, right? Ooh, wow. My first great sword. Now, I hate to say this, but even though I'm sort of playing paladin, my aim is to use a great sword, so I might as well try using it. See what it's like. What does it say? Heavy load. So if I equip this, I'm going to have a heavy load. I get this, but what if I do this? Okay, let's explore these ruins. 
And let's see what items I might be able to find. Any shiny skulls about? Doesn't look like it. Wait, actually. People died here. So there must be something here. Worth it. Yeah? That's worth stain. What's this? Could this... What was it? Could this be a precious item? Oh man, I hate these guys. Okay, so... We can way back to... The ruins. See what items are around. You know what? Let's go back to that area. I definitely have a heavy load. But I might be able to just kill them. This looks like a very impressive greatsword, by the way. I'm really liking the design. I've been into long swords since Lord of the Rings, to be honest. Also, of course, after playing Dark Knight and Final Fantasy XIV, it's like huge weapons now. What the hell? Oh no, oh no, 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 oh no. Alright, so... I definitely need to get my movement back. Because uh, it's probably better to not die. What happens if I inequip my sword though? Let's just inequip this. Is that better now? Equip load is less. Alright, there you go. Dodge is back. Yeah. Back to being a corporate espionage, you guy. And the skulls are around. I'm not sure about theirs. Right, item there. Rune fragment. Oh, I just remembered these breaking stuff doesn't give you anything, but sometimes you, you find items lying about. This is one hit to kill, but a group long sword isn't, so that's interesting. Okay. Looks like a trap. Nothing here though. Okay, so I figure oh what's this? Oh it's a message. If only I had a giant Oh you gotta be kidding me. Come on. Real mature guys, real mature. Okay, I see somebody sitting there. Hopefully that guy with the shield doesn't notice. And he did. Uh oh. 
that's why people were dying here. He calls everyone once he sees you. Okay, that's not good. Can I hide in the bushes now? No? No, I can't. Oh, uh oh. Why can't I? Okay, so I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight people to kill. It's gonna take a lot of help. Okay, so, two down, how many more to go? Quite a lot to go. Like six more, six or seven more to go. I saw some people go there, no, not there. Our materials, keep hiding though. He's somebody there, but he's looking this way. I need to be careful with this guy. Or I could just go attack that one guy that calls everybody else. Dropped an item. Better be a nice item. There he is with the shield. Question is: Is this grass tall enough to hide me, or dense enough to hide me? That's a real question. Okay, find a new item. Whew, exciting stuff. Yeah, come on. <sighs> oh, he can't see me. I'm John Cena, mate. Oh, wait. Shoot, he can't see me. Shoot! Oh man, no, he can't, he can do that? Okay, let's see. Okay, let's just do this. Oh, 
Okay. I'm running out of things to do. Okay, you ready for this? Whoa. Oh, okay. Oh, jump function works. Ah, oh, dang. I didn't. I did. I died. That could have gone better. Stake of Marika. Last sight of Grace visited. Just literally right there. So I've definitely gone a bit weak on the whole. Lost my skills a bit. Keep forgetting that I my attack speed is actually pretty good. Wonder if it's another chest here. And there is. What item awaits us now? A flail. Ooh, violent. Definitely found some. Uh, what's this? Is this poise? I'm not sure what poise is, but okay. Okay, I'm gonna do something crazy now, guys. Going to... What is this map, anyway? Equipment. Can I get this guy without getting him to alert everybody else? That should be, that is the challenge. I did. I killed him. Nice. Okay, now. You can see the big guy with the pike is coming towards me. 
But if I reduce all the other enemies, I might be able to take him down. Okay, go away please as fast as you can so I can get rid of these enemies right here Ooh, double items man Pretty cool. Okay, so now when this guy starts to move towards that fire again, I'm going to go and kill that guy who's behind this wall. Well, I was going to, but now I see there's other soldiers there, so I messed up. It's a big time. Or have I? Wait, I can't... So we can't dodge. Wait, unless... What happens if I get rid of... My shield? Can I... Equipment... Rid of... Shield? Oh, that's the real reason I can't use it effectively. It's not because of the mass of it. It's because my strength rating is low. Uh, there's dogs there. Can you sneak up on dogs? Maybe you can actually. That should be quite interesting. Please don't smell me. Hey, hey, thank God for game stupidities. gonna run now see what happens yeah come on dog come on dude thinks he's like sif or something one hit kill baby yes this is why we love great swords He's walking that way. Grab this item there. Should be able to kill this guy without a hitch. Okay, and then I should be able to kill. Is that guy dog sleeping? This guy. Uh, uh, that w so that wasn't quite the sneak attack I was looking for, obviously. Come on, come on doggy.
Very weak looking dog, isn't he? Okay, now. What's in here? Okay, what's this? Oh, my first skill. Okay. And a veteran knife that I used to add the skill. Okay. How many more enemies are around here besides this big guy? Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. I nearly died there. I'm backstabbing, hopefully. Alright, so he's taken a lot of damage this time. Oh no, I nearly had him. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, really? No. God, that is so disappointing. I'm so disappointed in myself right now. I literally had the guy in the palm of my hands. Literally, the guy would have died. Where are my shiny ruins? Oh, they're right there. Okay. There you go. I need to retrieve my ruins 